right, I got a train Symbio 700. So, we go into the app and we start Symbio. You hit the Bluetooth button, you hit some shade. Good luck with that. Click on it, and it will tell you to hit this button over here. <clears throat> All right, so going into alarms. We were getting all kinds of sensor alarms. I corrected that, but did, none of them are installed, so that was simple uh, fix. And we were getting a couple criticals, uh, proving lockout. So basically, proving lockout is our auxiliary contact down here on the bottom of the contactors is going back to our subboard and we're getting a wire diagram and this is where I'm having a problem so we got circuit one auxiliary yellow and brown circuit one auxiliary yellow and brown Circuit two will be red and black and blue and black. Circuit two, red and black and blue and black. This is this is where I I, I had to call tech support on this one and they told me I was chasing after some junk. So I go into tools, service test mode. Um so we're going to go to stop the unit and I'm going to turn cool one on for you guys. This is the kicker, y'all see that? Y'all see cool one. See what contactor it pulled in. Alright. So now I come over here and that's that's showing me right here. Clear as day. Circuit two. What the heck man? What the heck? So I ended up cutting the wire, jumping it out so both the compressors come on at the same time. Um, I, I don't know what else to do at this point. You can see I come in and I'll shut cool one off and I'll turn cool two on and it turns cool one on. So they're either going to have to update this wiring diagram which was released on November 2022 or figure something out because that's 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 where my issue is here folks it's with the auxiliary sensors hooked up it tries to run tries to run in a, a different mode and it's trying to stagger the compressors and it's locking us out so we're going to close the symbio app on there go back to my testos I got temperature clamps on both my discharge lines. We have a discharge sensor, a discharge sensor. We got high pressure, we got low pressure. All of them could cut it out, so is what it is. 
Symbio's ready. Let's see this baby get some action. Yay, 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 yay. Bluetooth button to connect. Very well, just might have a delay. No equipment found. Ah. Stop command. That was before the reset. Yikes. So we have to shut that stop command off. Now it's on auto. So we go back to the home screen. Auto. We have call for cooling. Feel the blower contactor just kicked on. That's a condenser fan. You got to be careful about touching stuff like that because you'll set faults off. That the hard way. That's what some of them contactor faults were. We got good temps, good pressures. I'll let it run for a good half hour. That unit's running. I'm over here. I did a leak search on that beast. Everything appears to be good with that one. Had a temporary belt on it. Loose belt. Made it ice up. So, All right, this is my headache today, guys. Explain to me, though. If you made it this far and you're still watching, explain to me why. I'm getting circuit one and circuit two, but it's backwards. Uh, tech support said that's normal. So, not normal to me, folks. Not normal to me. Please like, subscribe, follow. Put out them comments. Let me know what you're thinking, man.